Hello there. Bonsoir. This is Pato. And I'm uh, at the honey tree in the woods. I gotta build up my endurance. So I'm taking the long walk. Check this out. This is the honey tree. Made it this far. Although a little worse for the wear. Big crack in the tree right here. The tree's probably hollow. I mean, that's why the V's are in it. But it hasn't tipped over. And we have some type of, uh, I don't know what the hell this stuff is. Bee shit, maybe. I don't know. It's all down the tree. Indicating, well, no, these are dead fucking bees, man. This is crazy. Look at this. I didn't see this. You know, I, I have to have glasses, you guys. Look at this. I don't know if you can see. This is all dead bees, man. I thought this was just like bee shit. It didn't really look close. It looks like bees mixed in with some honey debris. Maybe this is just a natural die-off. Wow, it's all down the tree. Here. Oh, God. I don't know if... Um, hopefully, if anybody's interested in this, they can see this. I've been keeping an eye on this beehive here for at least two years, maybe three. And, uh... It has been getting smaller through the years than it used to be, but look at this, man. And it could have been this, you know, the tree split open a little bit. They got weathered and died. And if I can see, this is all bees. Wow. Thousands. And that beehive wasn't that, this beehive wasn't that active. The bees have been, you know, dying off, I guess. I don't know. Oh, that's fucking sad. But this tree is going to go over any time. And I've scoured these woods, and I haven't seen any other bee nest anywhere, not honeybees. And uh, even even the uh, the wasp and the hornets I haven't seen. This tree's about getting ready to fall over. So is that one. Um, we had a lot of heavy snow, lots of wind. This has been a really, really bad winter. It's nice today. It's about 36. I'm just going to go pan through here because I want to show this other tree. This tree. I mean, I love nature. If you're going to watch this video, you have to love nature. It snapped right off in the half here. Interesting. I think anyway. But the forest is, is dying. I've been saying this. All the forest around these areas we live in. It seems like it's that way everywhere. The trees are just rotting out. There's not that many saplings, and the saplings that are coming up don't look that healthy. Gotta tell you. And, uh, wow, the bees. The bees, man, they're dying. Well, I said I was going to document this, and it's been a couple of years now. And, uh, dead bees. We'll see if it comes back at the uh, beginning of the spring. Man, I hope so. And here's a little lake out in the middle of the woods over here. Here's a house in the lake. I'm not going to show the house. Try not to. A beautiful area. I don't see a lot of animal tracks. But we did just have a little bit of snow the last couple of days. A couple of just here and there. And, uh, this is all swamp. Normally. Or marshy, swampy, whatever. And it's going to be really bad once the snow melts. I'm trying to trudge through here right now in these boots. And they're about a foot up. Can't handle more than a foot of water, so I'm trying to be careful here. But one more thing: this is the unemployment station, so I'm the unemployed trying to get healthy here after a bout with the flu and some other things. A friend of the court, and you know, a couple of interviews and did a couple side jobs. Um, look, I don't believe in prosperity. Uh, prosperity, oh, <laughs> excuse me, being part part of any type of blessing, but I do believe that um, your health is. And I don't have a lot of prosperity people, but. I, I am healthy, and I think that will see me through the, uh, these hard times, and I thank everybody for the comments. Um, I'll get back to you th through the MySpace, because I can't seem to get the YouTube to work, and uh, so I'm stupid with computers, and uh, one thing I want to touch on is my whole neighborhood, it seems like, is on disability, and I don't know if anybody's seeing this besides me, but, you know, I sort of did a consensus through the blocks around my house, and and it's pretty amazing how many people are on disability and don't work. Now, disability is sweet because 
you can be mental disability or and really you don't seem to have anything anything wrong with you at all but you know of course there's mental disability so I guess they're dis disabled mentally but but uh I, so I sort of took notice of these people that were on disability and one of the things I noticed is that they all have like nice cars they always have disposable income to go to movies and they have free medical and um, they're always like buying things little things you know little trinket things that you don't fucking need like iPhones and all these little uh, they always have the games and the flat screens TV and it's kind of weird because these, all these people are all of them are younger than me and they've been on disability for years they never really worked too many years in their life and uh, boy man they, I'm not putting these people down or anything but or saying they don't deserve it but how sweet man because these people are going to the gym and working out and they're you know they're going to restaurants and movies and and buying things I'm thinking you know that's a sweet deal I just wonder how many people in everybody's neighborhood is on some type of disability and uh, they don't have to really worry about work anymore because I mean you know, if you're 40 years old you're on disability man I mean you can live to be 80 for 40 years man you can get this it's not like unemployment it doesn't run out but anyway, this is uh, Plato, and I'm heading out. I can already uh, talk here. I'm so dry mouthed. Bye.